Hello, I'm Holden Ramey with the Cattle Facts Closing Bell. Today's Closing Bell is sponsored by Commodity Ingredient Hedging LLC. From the late spring to early fall, the northern fed cattle market typically trades at a premium relative to the south. While this year certainly is no different, the spread has become substantially more pronounced as of late. In late May and early June, the Kansas-Nebraska fed steer spread was relatively steady at around $5 a hundredweight. However, after last week's cash trade, the spread nearly doubled towards $10 a hundredweight. Historically, there are only a few times the spread between the northern and southern markets has been wider. The difference in fed cattle supplies has been one of the driving factors behind the growth in the spread. The northern supply of fed cattle has been tight. Show lists in Nebraska and Colorado have been shopping around seasonal lows since mid-April. This has been partially a function of delayed calf-fed marketings. In the south, the Kansas show list has been tightening contra seasonally and is historically small. Even so, the southern supply of fed cattle remains supported by a seasonally increasing panhandle show list. This past week, the combined Texas and Oklahoma show list crested 100,000 head for the first time since 2022. Going forward, the Kansas-Nebraska fed steer spread will likely remain elevated in the near term. However, with fed cattle supplies expected to tighten in the south and grow in the north, the spread will likely narrow into the late summer and early fall. Turning to this week's markets, at the time of recording, significant cash trade had not developed across any regions. After pushing higher early in the week, the live cattle complex has traded somewhat sideways. The August contract is currently trading just under 184. Feeder futures are also likely to finish lower on the week. The August contract is nearly $2.50 per hundredweight softer, around $2.59, while September feeders have slipped nearly $2 to $2.61. The feeder cattle index was quoted just under $2.56 on Thursday, about $0.30 cents softer on the week. Thanks for watching, and remember to visit cattlefacts.com to become a member and receive the latest market news and analysis.